welcome back to Grace's room. Well, I'm back again making some more fluffy slime. Because the last time I made slime, it turned out well, but it didn't. It wasn't really the best slime that I've made because it didn't really wasn't as fun to play with. And also, I've been trying really hard to make a borax-free slime because borax isn't really the best for you. And so I've been experimenting at home using different ingredients, and I found out that. This, that these ingredients that I used here work the best and it turned out really well. So what you will need is some contact solution. Now this replaces the borax. Some baking soda. Some shaving foam. And also some any PVA glue. Now a lot of people, a lot of you guys have been telling me to um, make a, um, to use Alma's glue. But I can't find any Elmer's glue here in Australia. It's really hard to find here. So I tried using this one. After trying a lot of different PVA glues, I tried this Illusions Glitter Glue because it worked really well. Like it made the slime much better and it was, worked really well. And also it has glitter in it. And who doesn't like gl glitter? <laughs> and I also have some silver glitter glue here because I want a bit of a silver tint to my... Um, glue as well to my slime as well so I decided to use a bit of silver glitter glue as well okay and what you will also need is a spatula or a mixing spoon some measuring spoons and some measuring cups okay oh and a, and a mixing bowl you definitely need this <laughs> okay so the first thing you are going to do is put your bowl to the side and you're going to get Half a cup, so you need half a cup of your PVA glue or glitter glue. Okay, so I'm just going to squeeze. This is a full bottle, so it should be easy just to get out. <laughs> so I think that's pretty much one cup, even a little bit over. Okay, so you're going to put the lid back on. Okay, now I'm going to be getting my bowl and I'm just going to pour this all in. Might need your spatula just to get out the little bits that are stuck inside and don't want to come out. Okay. I think that's pretty good. Maybe. <laughs> I like to get every single inch out. Yeah, that's enough. <laughs> okay. So it looks really pretty. I love this color. It's a nice blue. Okay. And now because I want the silver tint, I'm going to get my silver glitter glue and just pour a whole lot in. <sighs> Squeeze. <sighs> I was really surprised at how well the contact solution works when I was um, doing it because it just came together really well. All right, now I'm just gonna mix the silver in just roughly. I can add some more in at the end. All right, now you will need your shaving foam. Now you just need approximately a cup of it. You don't need exactly a cup, but just around a cup. So I'm gonna be using some shaving foam. Oops, what's wrong with this? Don't, I swear there is shaving foam in here, but it's not gonna work. There we go. Just gonna do one more little squirt and I should be done. Okay, that's all. Huge mistake, guys. You should always need to stock up on your shaving cream. I just stole this from my dad's cupboard, so I just used what was left. Okay, it's gonna pour that all in. Oh, this looks like whipped cream. I know I said that on the last video. <laughs> Okay, now I just need to get this off my spatula. Alright, that should be good. Now put this to the side and now what you need to do is just mix this all really well together. I love this blue colour. So pretty. Okay. Just going to mix it. You know what I just realised right now? I was wearing this exact same t-shirt in the last time I was making fluffy slime. What a strange coincidence. Uh, 
okay. That looks pretty good. I can just give it a good overall mix at the end. Okay, oh, I was sending my tippy toes. All right, now the last thing you will need to do is get your baking soda. And I like to, and I like to use a quarter of a teaspoon, but I realize that you don't need too much baking soda. If you use too much, it just breaks apart in your hands and it's not fun to play with. Like that's what happened in my last video, even though I didn't use baking soda, I just, it just kept on breaking apart in my hands. It felt like really sandy, like a sand inside of it or something. So I like to use half of a tea, half of a quarter of a teaspoon. And I know I even tried using a full half quarter of a teaspoon and it just was breaking apart of my hands. So you just don't need too much of this. Ugh. Okay. Even a little bit less than that. Can't get it. <laughs> All right, I got it. So that, just that much, that's all. All right, just that little bit will do heaps. I think it makes it a bit stretchier than normal when you add this in. So just mix it in really well. And it shouldn't be too clumpy when you mix it together. It should just be nice and normal. It's gonna get all that glitter glue off the bottom. And just for good luck, I'm gonna add a little bit more of my silver because it's mostly blue. That's better. All right, I'm gonna finish that bottle. <laughs> okay, mix that in. Let's get off all the edges so you can get all of it in. All right, so I think that's pretty well mixed. I'm pretty happy with that. And now for the activator, which is your contact solution. So you're just gonna open it up and you don't use too much. I used uh, like so much of it last time and it just turned out like rubber. It wasn't stretchy or anything, but it, yeah, it's just, unless you want rubber slime, add, just add the whole bottle. <laughs> so you just need, just like maybe two squirts at the start and just start off with that. And, it, and it, as you can see, it's already starting to get, go a little bit off the edges of the bowl. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna add a little bit more. Just two squirts at a time, I say. One, two, or three. <laughs> and as you can see, it's already, like, you can just see that little, like, slimy thing that's just coming together. I must say, you don't need a little bit of the contact solution, because a little bit won't do it. Like, I just, and also, the contact solution is a little bit stickier than normal borax, so it's, it's swear, it's still fine, it's, Perfect, but it's just a little bit stickier. A little, little bit. Okay, I need a little bit more. Now, I say you keep on mixing until it stops sticking to the bowl. So it's still sticking to the bowl, so I'm not done yet. But it's working really well. As you can see, it's not like in the last video, clumping like big chunks together like only little bits were working it's just all smooth oh why don't I close it <laughs> so a little bit more and I close it again <laughs> see look how well this is turning out I must say it's a challenge to mix though <laughs> oh, oh, oh. need a little break <laughs> It's working. Ooh, it's working really well. So much better than the last time. It does take a little bit to mix, a little bit longer than the borax to mix, but it's worth it at the end. Really worth it. Okay, this should be my last amount of contact solution to add, and then maybe I might be able to start playing with it in my hands. I just want to leave the bottle open because while you're playing with it, it is still sticky, so you want to add a little bit more. Okay, that looks really good. But just, just in case, I'm going to add a little bit more because I don't want to get really sticky hands and I won't be able to play with it. Okay. It does also take a little while to like play with it in your hands to make sure like it stops sticking. But yeah, again, it's totally worth it. So as you can sort to start to realize that it's not really sticking to the bowl anymore. It's sticking to the bowl now because it's all 
around it, but I'm just going to get it off the edges. Okay. So that's, that's looking really good now. So now I can just say it's not sticking to my spatula anymore, so that's really good. Ooh. And now I can just start to pull it out with my hands. Oh, this feels amazing. For some reason, I think because you're not adding in all the ingredients like last time, it just feels so much more like fluffy. You can actually feel that fluff so much more. I just really like how simple it is to make. Okay, so I've got it all out. It's not sticking to the bowl. But it's still sticking to my hands a little bit. Okay. <laughs> One day I'll get it off of the bowl. Okay, that's pretty good. So put the bowl to the side of my elbow. <laughs> and, oopsies. <laughs> and now I'm just going to play with it. So you just need to play with it in your hands for a little while and just work it. See how much better, look how much better it is. It's so much more fluffier and it, it's such a good recipe. <laughs> Works so well. I think James might be on PlayStation again. All right. So it's not completely unsticky. So I'm just gonna go ahead get my contact solution, my trusty contact solution, and add a little bit more. All right. Cool. And you just play with it in your hands, and you soon you'll start to realize that it's not sticking as much so it does take a little bit but it will work eventually and also what i found out this is a really good stress reliever because it's so fluffy especially the fluffy slime it's just so fluffy just takes everything off your mind it's just like you can't help but think of how fun it is to play with honestly <laughs> stressing about my homework i'm playing with my slime Okay. So sometimes what I like to do because I love glitter. Honestly, I love glitter. James, <laughs> you must be playing FIFA. <laughs> okay. So now what I need to do is add. Oh no, I don't need to. But I just like to add a little bit of my like glitter glue just during it because the silver tin doesn't really work that much but you can still see it i'm really sorry this takes a little bit of time just to get off your hands oh it's on my elbow it's working now it's not it's not sticking to my hands it is a little bit so i don't want to keep you guys waiting all day but I just want to say, because it's going to take a little while to get all the amount, right amount of contact solution. But I just want to say, you don't add too much, otherwise it will go rubbery. So it feels like you're just playing with shaving foam right now. Okay, so just along while you're making, you just need a little bit of contact solution at a time until it stops fully sticking to your hands, even just a little bit. But I don't want to keep you guys waiting all day, so I think this is pretty good for now. So it's it's not it's not sticky. See, you just need a little bit more contact solution, and it will work. Okay, I might stop it there because it's gonna take a little while, but by soon maybe um soon it will come together, and I'll be playing with this all day. Okay, so it is so much fun to make. I honestly love playing with it so much. And I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. And it's so simple. Like, you just need everyday house items you can just get from, like, your cupboard. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I will see you next time on Grace's Room. Bye for now. Just need a little bit more.